Hey everyone, so I am here with my dad, Billy Pouch, and we're here in his trophy room in French Town, New Jersey, and today we're gonna give you guys a little trip down memory lane. This one here is pretty cool. That's Atlantic City with me and Tony Siscone. Um, that was my dirt car from 76, and uh, I won like 28 races with it that year. And uh, at the end of the year, we were looking for somewhere to go, and there was an asphalt race at uh, Atlantic City, so we went there and uh, we qualified on dirt tires, and then we took them off and put a, put a set of asphalt tires for a feature. And uh, I think I, I bumped, there was an accident, I bumped the front end and it broke the steering box, so it wasn't a very long day. But uh, that was then. <clears throat> Some of the spring car pictures from Grandview, winning a lot of races at Grandview with a spring car with a Zemina's team, uh, with and without a wing. You know, we got some more asphalt here. This was Nazareth National when we ran the dirt cars up there on the pavement. Um, the Chesson boys, that's little Billy, who's big Billy now. And the two Chesson boys, Peter, PJ, and uh, Jamie, who both ran spring cars later on. Got pictures with most of the crews that I raced with through the years. Uh, pictures with some of the drivers I raced with. Picture me and Ken Brand in that one right here. That's me and Kenny Brand after a race. This section here, Syracuse, when we went up there at the end of the year with with the 15, the 126, the 5, the de Blasio 5, the Parker bus car. Um, that's a lot of them pictures. Um, this picture here of my own car winning the Flemington 200. That was a big race at Flemington we won. Um, picture here with AJ Foyt when I was out at Indy Fairgrounds and running the Silver Crown cars at the, at the Mile Dirt and AJ was there racing too, and I got to get my picture with AJ, that was pretty big. Picture here, my rookies at Flemington. Probably one of the first rookie races I won at Flemington in 75. There's a picture of uh, little Mandy and <laughs> little Billy when you guys were small. That's probably a bridge board it looks like. Here's a picture of Christy Whitney. It's when she was governor in New Jersey. I, I took her out my two-seat driving school car in New Egypt and give her some laps around there. That was a lot of fun. Um, pavement racing here, Dick Greenfield Dodge truck when I got to go run some races on pavement with the trucks. Um, pictures of my win at Syracuse when we beat the outlaws up there. Um, there's a picture down here of me driving a midget at, at uh, Phoenix, Arizona on the mile. That was pretty hairy. Picture of winning the race out at Knoxville, Iowa. And first trophies, these are probably some of my most cherished trophies here, most popular driver trophies uh, from Flemington, Bridgeport, and New Egypt and stuff. Uh, they mean a lot when the fans Boat Jane is the most popular driver. Means you're putting on a show and doing something right, I guess. It's all my championship trophies from Flemington when we won championships there. Uh, last, I think, seven years of dirt at Flemington, we won last seven straight years. We won the championship every year. Um, Every Auto Race News, uh, Driver of the Year or whatever, Northeast Leading Feature Winner. I forget how many years I did that. Over here, <clears throat> these big trophies here, uh, the Fulton 200, which I won six times, five straight years. Got a picture here, this is one Flemington Named the grandstands after some of the drivers. You got Paul Cole, 
uh, Stan Plosky, Sammy Beavers, Bobby Pickle, that's me, Ken Bren, Billy Osmond, and Joe Hall. It was pretty cool. We all had a grandstand section named after us. Come a little further down here, we got my 76 wins. I think six time winner of the Freedom 76. These are trophies from that, which pretty big race. Won a lot of money doing that. And then they used to have the Skull Series, uh, which I don't know what it's called now, but it used to be the Skull Series. And then when you won, you got a spit tune and they're from different tracks that I won, won the Skull Series from. Uh, July 15th, we're going to have our open house. We do this every other year where we invite the fans in to go through my trophy room, look at the old pictures, and, and uh, see a lot of the trophies and stuff. And we have the shop open where we work on the cars and maintain them and, and build them and stuff. So anybody interested wants to come see this kind of stuff, we have an open house. It's uh, July 15th from 12 to 4. And along with that, we'll have a lot of our sponsors will be here, like Pioneer Pole Building, Bish Sales, and uh, uh, we'll have hot dogs and snacks for free. Uh, we'll have snow cones and stuff. Bish Sales has a snow cone machine, so it's good for the kids if they want to come up and see, you know, where the race cars are worked on and how we do everything and, uh, you know, get pictures and, you know, we're here to sign autographs. We don't get a lot of time at the racetrack to do that so we try to take time and do it at the shop and have our open house so we can sit and talk to everybody.